When I was in junior high, I took a typing class in school. In fact, I was the only guy in the class. We were taught that when you reached the end of a line, you needed to press the return key to get back to the left margin and ready for the next line. Do you need to do that in Word? Stay tuned to find out. Typewriters have been almost completely replaced by computers running word processing programs such as Word. To answer my earlier question, you don't need to press enter or return at the end of each line. When you set up your page margins, Word is programmed to know that when you are typing along and you reach the right margin, your text should automatically wrap to the next line. In fact, you should only press enter or return at the end of paragraphs in your document. If you want to end a line before you get to the right margin, you can press enter or return, but then Word treats your line just like a paragraph. Pressing enter or return results in a hard return being entered in the document. You can see several hard returns on the screen here. Each of these indicates a place where enter or return was pressed. If you want a line to end before the right margin is reached, the proper way to do it is to press Shift plus Enter. This action results in a soft return, sometimes called a line break or a new line character, being entered in the document. Watch what happens when I press Shift plus Enter at this point in the line right here. Since I have non-printing characters displayed on the screen, I can tell the exact position of the line break because of the down and left pointing arrow. When you press Shift plus Enter, Word does not end the paragraph. It simply ends the line. You can only end a paragraph when you press Enter or Return. There is one other thing to remember about line breaks, but before I mention that, I want to invite you to click the subscribe button near the bottom right corner of this video. And if you click the bell, you'll be notified whenever I add new videos to the Word Tips channel. Now for that one other thing about line breaks. You need to realize that they can result in some strange line formatting. Let's go up to this paragraph right here, which I'm going to format to have justified lines by clicking on this tool right up here. When I do this, notice that Word inserts spacing in each line so that the lines extend all the way from the left margin to the right margin. It justifies according to those margins. It is only the last line of the paragraph that ends before the right margin is reached. Watch what happens though when I add a line break. Let's say we're going to add it right here at this point. Word breaks the line, as you can see from the line break symbol. However, it also stretched out the line so that it still went from margin to margin. It did this because, again, Word considers this broken line to be part of the larger paragraph, and I indicated that the entire paragraph should have justified lines. The bottom line for you is that you should only press enter or return when you reach the end of a paragraph. And if you want to break a line, use shift plus enter. But understand that it can affect the formatting and the appearance of the text on your screen. Thanks for spending some time with me today. I hope you enjoyed this video.